Good morning. Let's take a look at some cricket news now. And the Proteus coaching setup is in the news, and it's not for their cricket. Head coach Mark Boucher issued a vague apology for his involvement in past transgressions as a player. His deputy, Enoch Ngwe, has also resigned. Yen says Thorny Ntimkulu has more on a dramatic day as the Cricket SA transformation hearings resumed. Appointed interim coach in 2019 following the departure of Otis Gibson, Enoch Ngwe was then made assistant coach months later as Mark Boucher was seconded to the top job. Details of Boucher's allegedly improper appointment have been the subject of CSA's social justice and nation building project hearings. So at that meeting, Dr. Ford appointed Graham Smith. Uh, told, informed the meeting that he was appointing Graham Smith as the director of cricket, who demanded that he would only work with Mark Boucher. It was his demand as head coach. And therefore, Enoch had to be demoted to deputy. A Times Live report suggests Ngwe is aggrieved in a working environment where he is effectively operating as the 12th man with his inputs not being valued. In a short statement, CSA have confirmed Ngwe's resignation but say talks are ongoing to seemingly keep him in his position. News of the high-profile resignation came hours after head coach Mark Boucher's own statement on allegations made against him at the transformation hearings. The former Proteus wicketkeeper apologized for what he called real or perceived inappropriate behavior on his part. Although Boucher's statement does not detail specific situations he is apologizing for, he has spoken to the Proteus as it prepared to leave for Sri Lanka on Wednesday. He provided clarity and context, and I think it was more about just keeping the guys um, within his comf confidence. Meanwhile, the Office of the Transformation Ombudsman has given those implicated at the SJN hearings individual extensions to submit their responses to the claims against them. Shonin Timkulu, Johannesburg.